transcendental experience here. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Are you kidding me? Am I seeing what I'm seeing? This is a lifetime fantasy come true. Okay, I know, you're like, oh, he's just looking at a mango tree in Florida or down in San Diego. No, he's not. No, he's not. He's looking at the most northerly growing mango tree possibly in the world. The most northerly, consistently fruiting, perennial mango tree that has been outside, unprotected, the farthest away from the equator, the closest to the Arctic Circle in the entire world. Maybe in Spain, or I'm not sure. I have to look at the latitudes, but if somebody's growing one of these things farther north than Pittsburgh, California. <laughs> yeah, see what I'm saying? Pittsburgh, California. Yeah, that's north of Fremont. You betcha. This tree is way bigger. There's a tree in Fremont that's fruiting also, but this tree is way bigger. Look at the caliper size on this tree. We've got probably six inches here six inches of caliper it splits right up in the middle grows up and yeah it's got some funky little discoloration from older leaves right but uh you haven't really pruned it out but look at how successful this tree is and so obviously these people know what they're doing because look here's another one here's another one yeah now do i see a graft point <laughs> No graft point. So I'm gonna knock on the door, see if I can find out what the heck is going on. But I'll tell you why this tree is succeeding here. Okay, we, uh, Pittsburgh is right next to the bay. You can't see it, but the bay is down that way. In fact, you might be able to see it way down there. It's not really the bay, it's where the, the bay meets the, the delta. But all along that corridor, it's fairly frost free. The other thing that's going on here is we are in the hills of uh, the foothills that lead up to the, I guess it would be the north side of the Diablo range. And there you see the hills, right? So these hills basically drain cold air away. And you see there's a slope all the way down this road, all the way down. And it slopes all the way down to the edge of the water at the Delta Bay interface. So all the cold air, cold and heavy air is slowly moving out of here. You've got all kinds of asphalt, uh, concrete, hard material. You've got a stucco house. You've even got a little bit of overhead protection from queen palms. And this is creating the magic that's creating the most northerly fruiting mango tree, certainly in California and quite possibly the world. Now, if there's one farther north you know about, then I'm certainly open to go check it out. This one's gotta be about 13, 14 feet tall. Um, it's probably got 50 mangoes on it of various sizes. It's probably 15 feet wide. It's probably, it looks like it had to have been here for at least eight or nine years. And um, one thing, if you're gonna try to grow mangoes, you wanna at least be able to have queen palms in your neighborhood. If you don't have queen palms near you, you shouldn't even try. Now, you really need to have people growing king palms, bougainvillea, Meyer lemon trees, um, hibiscus. Those are the indicator plants that tell you that your climate is probably good enough to grow a mango. But if you're growing those things in San Francisco, where it's really foggy, you're not gonna get fruit like this. The beauty of places like Fremont and Pittsburgh that are next to these bodies of water, they get heat buildup, okay? It's really hot out here. It's like 90 degrees right now. San Francisco, I guarantee it's probably maybe 71. Okay, these trees really like the heat and that's why they're fruiting so prolifically here. All right, so we're gonna start selling these trees and um, I'm gonna learn everything I can about these trees so that uh, everybody up here can have fresh mangoes which are way better than the pesticide ridden mangoes that come up from Mexico. So there you go. I'll leave you with a couple shots of beautiful, beautiful, beautiful mangoes grown in Northern California in the San Francisco Bay Area.
thought it couldn't be done, there it is, right in front of you. Case closed.